If you're anything like me, then gyms are simply not your favourite place to visit. Especially in The Sims, because the lots on offer are about as drab as waking up on a Monday morning. But we're here to change that, with 10 ideas to make your gyms become more than just an ugly workout machine in a corner. Let's jump into it. First up is to spice up your workouts with entertainment. Sims can watch TV and run on a treadmill at the same time, so setting up TVs for your Sims to tune into as they run can help raise a Sims' fun need as they sweat it out. You can even go a step further and create a room with mood lighting, mirrors, and pumping speakers blasting music. This can just add a cool vibe to working out and give gyms a bit of a point of difference when compared to chucking an exercise machine in a room in your sim's home. Changing the colour and intensity of lights in the room can be a fun way to mix it up and alter the look and feel between visits too with minimal effort. Next up is just to consider the vibe of your gym. While yes, there's nothing wrong with a polished modern building, you could even make a gym that has much more of a warehouse kind of feel to it for your edgier sims to visit. If you have the city living expansion pack, then the garage door murals can tie in really nicely with this and means that sims can spend some time painting when they visit the gym for something a bit different. Yes, it's a bit random, but we're not going to question it because it's The Sims. Similarly, utilizing large balconies or rooftops can add an awesome outdoorsy vibe to a gym that again breaks up the atmosphere and how clinical they can often look. For the third idea, it's all about water. You can add a pool to your gym, and this can be a larger pool to swim laps in, or something smaller just for a quick dip. I also like to make very small pools that can act as a kind of recovery pool. Usually these are either heated to be quite warm, or alternatively they're ice cold, but you know, we're just going to have to pretend all of that's a thing because really, they're just little pools in The Sims. Using actual spas can be a good option as well, and it gives your gym a woohoo location. And if you have the spa day game pack, then adding in a sauna is another great option, both as a relaxing activity and as an additional woohoo location. Something I mentioned in my ideas to improve spa lots video that can also be applied to gyms is to create a kind of sensory deprivation chamber using using the sleeping pods from the Get Famous expansion pack. While these are like fancy beds with additional features, they have a lot of awesome upgrades. For example, the Sarcadian Tweaker upgrade will mean that a sim's bladder and hygiene, along with their energy need, will all increase when they're sleeping inside, making it feel like a fancy treatment. Moving on to a quick idea, being to create a room for boxing. I'm not going to lie, I feel like if you just chuck a punching bag right next to a piece of workout equipment, then you're committing a crime. And before you call me out, yes, I have committed this crime before. Punching bags are base game, and a room or area for boxing can just make your gym feel as if it caters for different sims and different types of workouts. For the fifth idea, we're more looking at a gym concept rather than an add-on, and it will require the city living expansion pack. The idea is to consider making a basketball gymnasium. This makes shooting hoops and getting those slam dunks in the focus of the lot, rather than simply weight machines and treadmills. However, if you go down this path, then I absolutely recommend including a small gym too, just to make it a more versatile space. I just really like this for something completely different and for the high school musical vibes. And I feel that while most gyms give off adult vibes, it can be a type of gym that really caters to all ages. I've popped this gymnasium onto the gallery, and while I am rather chuffed with how it looks inside, I will apologise for the fugly exterior. Sorry, the basketball courts made the build need to have a very big box, and I wasn't quite sure how to save it. I did try. Let's keep going, and a quick idea now is to include ways to make your sim energised. A sim who's energised will train their fitness skill faster, making your gym the perfect place to visit for a workout. This could be as easy as having a sim drop off a few crystals from the crystal collection and enabling their emotional aura to give nearby sims an energised moodlet. Or it could just be about including a change room with showers, allowing sims to have a brisk shower which gives them an energised moodlet. This also leads us to the seventh idea, which is to add a small cafe to your gym. Note that this will require the Get Together expansion pack. Not only does a cafe help to make your gym more of a social place, but drinking coffee will provide an energized moodlet, which fits in really well when you're about to work out. You could even consider having a tea brewer somewhere on the gym lot, as drinking oolong tea will give a powerful energized moodlet. 
Overall though, I feel like Cafe gives your gym more purpose. If you don't have the Get Together expansion pack, then you could alternatively make do with a bar, and if you have the Snowy Escape expansion pack, then you can also pop in vending machines if you feel like they fit in. Next up is to consider adding in a yoga studio or meditation space. You'll need the Spa Day game pack for this, but it does add some very awesome and very relaxing activity to your gym. Plus it also gives your sims a location to work at as a yoga or meditation instructor and make some extra money. While often you might want to go to a spa lot for this, it can still work well in a gym too. Hosting classes at a gym can even feel a little bit like personal training. Well, kind of, that's a little bit of a stretch I know. The next idea will require the Get Together expansion pack and it's to create a club hangout area in your gym. Having a fitness related club is something that you'll likely end up having in your game and making a club specific room can help bring that club to life. Offering members an exclusive place to train, socialize, and all around live their best life getting fit. Maybe club members get better equipment, who knows? Well, you do. You get to choose the perks and what goes into the club room. A side note is to save up and buy the fitness skill boost perk for your club, which will mean that sims train the fitness skill faster while in an active club gathering. Finally, the 10th idea is just to think about lot traits for your gym. A good one to include is bracing breezes, which will boost the rate in which your sims gain the fitness skill and can also give an energized moodlet. Other traits can help depending on what vibe you want. For example, the team hangout lot trait can be helpful if you wanted your gym to have a younger vibe, which could fit in well with a basketball gymnasium. And with that, we've reached the end. That's 10 ideas to help improve gym lots in The Sims 4. If you enjoyed or found this helpful, then please subscribe and leave a like. I would really appreciate it and have an amazing day. See you later.